With about as much fanfare as you would expect, the biggest star this sport has ever seen, Conor McGregor, is back tonight. And now let's see how he performs. Certainly he has handled everything during fight week quite well. How does he handle fight night? We're going to get some answers here shortly, Joe. Missed with that attempt. That is... Oh, man, this dude is good. Another huge kick is true. Well, few fighters manage distance as efficiently and as well as Conor McGregor, and there's that left hand finding its home early. Oh, he does a great job of setting you up, man. You saw it in the Jose Aldo fight. The guy will just step back a little bit and bang, drops the straight left on you. That can end your night. He not only throws this fast, he also is so accurate, and that allows him to finish so many fights. Well-placed kick there by Emmett. We cross the midpoint in round one. And they clinch. Oh, he's got his back. Now he's got to start trying to drag him to the ground. Then he can look for submissions. Oh, nice straight left. Oh, punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Unable to connect with the right hand there. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. Oh, nice kick. Oh, nice strike by McGregor there. I mean, Conor McGregor is a fantastic striker, and once again, that skill is on display. Oh, what an offering up over the top. This fight's going to be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh! Huge kick to the head. 30 seconds. Oh! And this is why you pay to be in the building. Back and forth we go. Oh, nice right hand. Oh! He got him hurt bad here. Oh, so there's the horn at the end of the round. He got knocked down near the end of it. Saved by the bell. He will live to fight on. The question is for how long? All right, so a big round for him there, DC. We'll go back and look at some of the highlights. Big knockdown for him. We'll see if he can follow it up. You could see that he was flowing. Everything was working in accordance to what he wanted it to be. And at the moment that it showed itself, the moment that the opportunity arrived, he jumped on it, got that big knockdown, and now he finds himself ahead in this fight. Round two underway. Leg kick lands. Strike over the top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and he's a fight over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. All right, well, he rocked him pretty good, but... It... Oh! Head kick there blocked by Emmett. Oh, looks like he's got a cut above the eye here. Oh, beautiful job to get the kick home to the body. Another body kick lands. Oh, picture-perfect shot, shot there, there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. So we hit the three-minute mark here in the second round. 
So the blood really starting to flow every time. All right, good back and forth action, but they pause things here, DC. They're going to call in the ringside physician and take a look at what is a nasty cut. Well, he's got to check on it because you don't know if the fighter's going to be able to continue. Fighters always want to fight, but it's up to the ringside physician to tell them if they're capable of it. Well, the fighter certainly wants to stay in it. It's been a great fight thus far, and it looks like at least for now he's going to be allowed to stay in this fight. We'll see how long he can last. All right, so the ringside physician has made his way back to his seat. The referee gets the action back underway. The fans are excited this fight's going to continue. Absolutely, and I'm just as excited myself. I want to see these guys compete. I want to see who wins. I don't want it to stop because of a cut. I want to see... Oh! This could be it! Now he's back up. Oh! That is it! Oh, my goodness! I mean, you got to be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on SportsCenter tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. Here now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. All right, now for the particulars inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Well, back in 2016, he stopped Rafael Dos Anjos to realize a dream and become the UFC lightweight champion. Eddie Alvarez, the underground king, getting back at it here tonight. Coming up on 35 professional fights and figures to have a decided experience advantage in this matchup tonight. Beautiful body kick. Nice connection with the punch in the clinch. Nice double leg takedown attempt there, and you got to think that's something that's going to give him confidence moving forward in this fight. A lot of confidence when it happens that easily. He took a shot, he got a takedown. What now will stop him from doing it over and over again? Oh! Oh! Oh, both. Both landed. Oh, a beautiful hook by Holloway. Getting the hands going here early. Just out of range with the big right hand. Well, you see why Holloway is such a fan favorite. Beautiful land there with the left hand, and now we'll see what he can do with it. Two minutes have ripped off the round one clock. Oh, huge, huge strike, strike lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed upright. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. That one landed clean. And now a left. Oh! Back to his feet. Big uppercut. Oh, nice level change. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. And look at the post on the opposite side to give himself the correct space to land these beautiful knees. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Well, DC kind of just playing with him at this point, right? You think he's got to go in. Oh, my God. Oh, huge shots being landed on both sides. He's hurt again. 
Oh my goodness. Alvarez is done. Eddie Alvarez is done. Holy smokes. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. And now our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Mixed martial arts royalty, Dan Hendo Henderson ready to go for round one. His MMA career began with five consecutive first round finishes. And he's had a few of those in the UFC as well. Dusted Tim Boach in 28 seconds at a main event in New Orleans back in 2015. So Hendo's been a fast starter. You don't want to get hit with that H-bomb here in the first minute of the fight. Finds a home for the left hand there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish off now. He's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! Tried to land the punch, but a swing and a miss by Hua. All right, we'll see if he has any response. Oh! He has to evade Stan's face. Back to his feet. Oh, my goodness! Oh, big head kick there. Overhand block there by Shogun Hua. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Hua's forehead is bleeding now, cut is open. Leg kick lands. Oh, that one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, what a fight! Well, no denying that he rocked him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find the shot that would put him to sleep. He threw a lot of punches, but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. Oh, man. I mean, how much can one man take? He certainly doesn't look like he did when he walked out here just a few moments ago. He's almost unrecognizable. He's been hit. Oh! Appear to be in real trouble. Oh, nice leg kick. Just out of the range with that right hand. Under a minute to go. Well, you got to think it's only a matter of time. Yup, referee stopping the action here. That swelling is getting out of control. This might be the end.
C. It's bad. I mean, it's a lot of swelling. And it's the damage that he has taken over the course of the fight that is making him swell to a point that I don't know if he can continue. All right, we'll see if the doctor allows the fight to continue. It looks as though he will. Crowd loves it when the doctor lets the fight continue, don't I they? I, I love it. I love it when he <laughs> lets it continue, especially when you have a fight that has been as fun as this to this point. All right, so the ref will get the action back underway after that brief health and safety check. And to no one's surprise, the fans support the decision for the action. Oh, my goodness! And that will do it! Oh, my goodness! Well, that smile on his face is only going to be surpassed by the zeros on the check. A huge knockout tonight. Got to think some bonus money's coming his way. Bonus money is coming his way. When you knock somebody stiff like this, you expect a bonus check. What a phenomenal performance by this young man. All right, we go back inside the octagon to the veteran.